Hello, and welcome back to Road Trippia, the once-a-day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode is number 794, the category Friday Night Pub Quiz number 9. This is the Friday Night Random Trivia Quiz. The questions aren't too hard. Some of them tonight are a little harder than normal, but it's a pretty fun overall 21-question trivia quiz. Question 21 is at the very end of the video for a tiebreaker if you need it. If not, good luck. Question number one. Engelbert Humperdinck composed an opera about what two small children from a story by the Brothers Grimm in which the children foil the plans of a witch who wants to eat them. Those two children are Hansel and Gretel. Question number two. Which month got its name from the Latin word that means to open, referring to the opening of the buds on flowers and other spring plants? From the Latin word aperio, the answer is April. Question number three. A condition where a membrane swells against the eye's cornea, the acute form of conjunctivitis is commonly known as what condition that is highly contagious so students who catch it are often sent home. The answer is pink eye. Question number four. Also a term for any advantageous position in racing, what is the name for the front row on the inside of the first bend of the track that is given to the driver with the best time trial? The winner of the time trial gets the pole position. Pole position is the answer. Question number five. When graphed algebraically, these have identical slopes. In geometry, vertical lines placed close together denote this property. What is the term for these kind of lines that never touch? They never touch because they run parallel. Question number six. It was originally supposed to be accompanied by the Speedwell, but that ship couldn't make the voyage. It left in England in September and arrived at Cape Cod in November 1620. What is the name of this ship used by the pilgrims? The ship's name was the Mayflower. Question number seven. The seventh day of what month in 1941 was a date which will live in infamy because it was the month during World War II in which Pearl Harbor on the island of Oahu, Hawaii was bombed by the Japanese. The month was December. Question number eight. The modern form was invented in New Orleans sometime around 1820. What is the name of this card game that has several varieties, such as Stud, Draw, Omaha, and Texas Hold'em?
The answer is poker. Question number nine. He was king of Aragon. She sat on the throne of Castile. Who were these two monarchs that funded the Italian explorer Christopher Columbus's voyage to the New World in the year 1492? Looking for the name of the king and the queen. The answer is Ferdinand and Isabella. Question number 10. In Scandinavian mythology, what is the name for the series of events and catastrophes that will ultimately lead to the end of the world, culminating in a final battle between the gods and the demons and giants, ending in the death of the gods? The final battle is Ragnarok. Question number 11. Many chose this path to the Americas because they were poor and unable to afford passage. What name is given to servants who agreed to work for a certain number of years, often seven, and then they were given their freedom? That term is indentured servants. Question number 12. The capital version of the letter can be used to denote osmotic pressure and the product of several quantities. What is this Greek letter whose lowercase version denotes the ratio between a circle's diameter and circumference, approximately 3.14? The Greek letter is pi. Question 13. After he hit five total home runs during the 1977 World Series, the New York Yankees slugger Reggie Jackson secured his place in the Baseball Hall of Fame and became forever known as Mr. What? Reggie Jackson is known as Mr. October. Question 14. A cowboy riding an ostrich, an elephant with polka dots, a boat that can't float, and a lion with wings are members of what group found on an island featured in a television adaptation of Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer? That island was the island of misfit toys. Question 15. This spice is often added to a glass of eggnog. Its outer skin is dried to make a spice called mace. What is this type of evergreen tree that lends itself to a nickname of Connecticut? The answer is nutmeg. Question 16. Only one King of England has had this name, and he is known for signing the Magna Carta in 1215. What is this name also the name of the fourth book of the New Testament in the Bible? The name of the king and the fourth book is John, King John. Question 17. In Doom 3, it is the planet where the headquarters of the UAC research system is located. In Total Recall, the same planet 
gets an atmosphere. What is the name of this planet positioned between Earth and the asteroid belt? That planet is Mars. Question 18. What term describes both the cholesterol-containing mass that accumulates in the linings of the arteries causing blockage or the bacterial cells that accumulate on the surface of teeth causing cavities? It can describe both of those. The answer is plaque. Question 19. What is 555 feet high, located at the western end of the National Mall, shaped like an Egyptian obelisk, and is the tallest structure in the District of Columbia? The answer is the Washington Monument. And question 20. In England and Canada, this holiday is the day after Christmas and marked a time when the gentry gave servants gifts. What is this day whose name comes from the containers the gifts were given in? The name of that holiday is Boxing Day. Alright, that is it for today. Thank you guys for watching another Road Trivia Trivia Quiz. I feel like it's been a pretty good week. I feel like that Friday night pub quiz was a good one to go out on. Check back tomorrow. I believe tomorrow is Cool Cats Trivia, which is... Uh, well, I don't want to give it away. It's a good, it's a good trivia quiz. It's something, uh, I don't, it's pretty unique. I don't think we've done one too similar to it yet. So check back tomorrow to play Cool Cats Trivia. And then, as usual, we go into all the regular stuff next week. I think Sunday is celebrity-owned restaurants, so you can brush up on that before Sunday's trivia. And uh, I think that's about it. We'll just get right into question 21, the tiebreaker for today. In the early 1800s, these Bantu-speaking people were led by a warrior chief named Shaka. What is the name of this tribe that you will find near the end of your dictionary? The warrior chief's name is Shaka. The tribe's name is Zulu. Zulu. Thank you for watching. Check back tomorrow for Cool Cat Trivia. Sunday will be celebrity owned restaurants. And I don't think I have a Monday lined out yet. But let's have a good weekend. And uh, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow.